Hi, everyone. <clears throat> Looks like it's showing four in here. Hi, Kathy. I don't know if you're in here or you came in earlier. Welcome, welcome. Hi, Jess. How are you? There's Kathy and Lainey. How are you, sweet lady? And Levita, welcome. As you can see, I'm still at my son's. Family's supposed to be home tomorrow sometime. And then I get to go home. Hi, Pamela. And Robin, welcome, welcome. Hi, Addicted. Hi, Irene. Wow, we got 11 people in here already. If you hear a noise in the background, it's Roscoe drinking water. He, I swear he makes more noise. <laughs> and he's driving me crazy. <laughs> he wants to go in and out. Yeah. So how is everyone today? Are you ready for a sale and a chit chat? Yeah, Roscoe, he is, oh. And then I had some excitement uh, day before yesterday. The master bathroom flooded. So I finally got the bathroom all dry, but I got fans on the carpet. So that's been fun. Yeah, Roscoe's a handful. And then he didn't he doesn't like the sound of the fans. So he just kind of is a pest. Hi, Lynn. Yeah, I've actually left, left YouTube lives, but always watch at night. Thank you, Jeff. Oh, Lynn. I know you're not feeling very well, and so I can understand. Hi, Deborah. I so understand. Hi, Angie. So you, most of you know how I run this sale. Um, there's no pressure to buy. I have three drawings. Um, you may put your links in. You can talk amongst yourself. It's a no drama sale. Hi, Hetty. Hi, uh, Anne's Art in Craps. You say that right? <laughs> and welcome, welcome. And I have lots of jewelry, a variety of prices. Um, I'm going to have one piece of sterling silver today, and I've showed it before. I have two bags. I usually make two bags. They're a wearable craft lot. I basically sell them as a craft lot. They're 99.9% .9 wearable. And I always start them at $10. Uh, let's see. I You will get an invoice tonight. It might be late because um, going on uh, Evie's um, comedy hour. There's four of us. Let's see. Carol, Irene, me, and Evie. That you will get your invoice sometime tonight. You might be sleeping, but you'll get it. Thank you, Jess. Um, hi, Chris. And let's see. I appreciate uh, payment within 24 hours. I ship every Tuesday now. And hope you have fun. Remember, just have some fun. Um, you can talk about anything but politics, religion, and I do uh, welcome 
prayer request. But the reason why I say religion, I mean, don't talk about a particular church because, you know, we're not going to be in agreement. No politics and no C word. And let's get started and let's have some fun. And I hope everyone is doing well. I am tired uh, taking care of animals and the flood in the bathroom. I have something really different, uh, the Red Hat Society. And I have a lot. I've never got, you know, this many pieces before. But kind of neat. Okay. Here is the hat. I'm going to start the bid at um, $6 on this one. I have no idea if anyone would be interested, but I just got these a few days ago. The hat, the brooch. Here is a stretch bracelet, which is really pretty. It's in good condition. And here's a smaller brooch. Oh, this is really cute. I like that one better than the other one. And, and I'm going to sell these in a lot. So, and I have not seen... Look at this necklace. How about that? And you know what? It would be cute for crafts too. Because you know, I look at jewelry, not just to wear, but... Um, as jewelry art. Oh, and there's a lot of little charms. There's two there. Here's a pin. Whoops. A pin. And another charm. And there's some earrings. Oh, these are cute. Okay, there's earrings for pierced ears. Yeah, all of these are all hats. They're all hats. Those are earrings. They're really cute, actually. Like I said, I had no idea if anyone's interested in Hi guys. But I thought I'd present them anyway. They're all in good condition. Let's see. Let me count. Okay, the earrings. One. Two. Three. There's four pairs of earrings. There's one, two, three, four, five charms. And then there is a pin, a brooch, and a larger brooch. Hi, Barbie. We're, we're in the car headed to our dollars. Oh, I hate to miss. Maybe I can. Oh, you can watch the replay. And thank you for coming in. Uh, a cookout sounds neat. I don't blame you. I'd run to that too instead of watching an auction. <laughs> Hi. Like I said, I knew that, you know, not everyone's going to be interested in the Red, Red Hat Society. Jewelry. Hi, Buttercup. More uh, free uh, gifts will be out on Tuesday. 
I'm at my son's house, so I went and got it yesterday. I had forgotten to um, put it in with the rest of my stuff. It's been a crazy week, by the way. Crazy, crazy week. Anyway, if there's no interest, if you change your mind, let me know. And remember, you can always use these for crafts. If, you know, not ever... Not all women belong to the Red Hat Society. Actually, I know very little about it, but $6 starting bid. Okay, let's do something else. This is very, very cold. It is stone. Because they're green stones and I am going to start the bid at five on this one looks like the color of jadeite and like I said it's very very cold and then there's these wood beads in between it's a good stretch And I love the green. What I would do is I would remake this and take the wood out. I'm not a fan of wood jewelry. The stone is really pretty. Starting bid is uh, $5 on this one, if there's any interest. And it's a good stretch. And I see no interest. You know, I don't waste time. So uh, <laughs> just slow me down if you want to see it again. And I usually show the first two or three after a while when more people come in. Now, this is Monet. It is Hallmark. I have not seen a Monet necklace like this. Look at that. Excuse me a minute. <laughs> oh, got a message from my granddaughter. She's going to be watching bunnies and the lady is going to drop some stuff off for the bunnies today, but not the bunnies, thank God. Because my family will be home tomorrow. Okay, phone. Let me just send her a little message. Okay. Anyway, it's very nice. It's silver tone. And this one's hard to show because it's turning. I don't know what the green. It's not plastic. Probably just glass. Oh, did I miss? Let's see. Who did? Oh, hi, Dusty. Hi, Kelly. Stacy May. Hi. Welcome, welcome. Hi, Shanika. And this Hallmark Monet. Like I said, I have not seen a, a Monet necklace like this one. Okay, we'll do a pass on that. This is a bracelet and it has uh, a little cross on it. Let's see, who else did I miss? I apologize if I miss anyone. Do do. 
DL and Lace. I must have missed you up here somewhere. Welcome, welcome. Let me put my email address in, too. If you are new, um, send me your information. I need your YouTube name, your real name, and your PayPal email address. And even if you don't buy anything and you win something in the drawing, I need to know where to send it. This is really beautiful. The stones have the Aurora Borealis colors. There is a cross, and it is hallmarked Italy. And it's, it says Chapel, Italy. And I am going to start the bid at five on this one. It's in excellent condition. Has a spring ring clasp. It's a beautiful bracelet. And if you didn't want the cross on it, I think the cross is even more beautiful. But if you didn't, you could remove it. And I'm still on this optical stool. I tried to fix it with the pillow and it's too high. And with my short legs, I couldn't get on. So I will be glad when I'm back into my office chair at home. The colors on those beads. Look at those. Those are really beautiful. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Okay. And if you watch the replay and uh, you can make me an offer. Hi, Bo Lion. I'm doing good. <laughs> Roscoe, stop. I am animal sitting. Here is a really pretty brand new ring. It is a fashion ring. It's never been worn. And let me measure for you. It is gold tone. It is a size eight. Going to start the bid at six on this one. It, I'm sure, um, the stones are not real, but it looks like um, a created emerald. It's very pretty. I actually bought this for myself, but I decided I, I had um, another ring that was similar. It is very pretty, and it is brand new. This one's never been worn. Hi, 96. <laughs> you are a busy lady, 96. Hi, Myra. Anyway, starting bid is six on this one, if there's any interest. Hi, thrifty little cow. Suffering from summer cold here. Oh, the summer colds are miserable. I'm good, just tired because I had a bathroom flood. I am animal sitting, house sitting for my son and family, and they will be home tomorrow. Which So it's, you know, kept me busy. Well, work is good for you, bold lion. 
I've never shied away from work in my life. I started working probably on my dad's ranch when I was nine or 10 years old. And haven't stopped yet. Irene, who are you talking to? Everybody might email you. <laughs> no, 96, okay. <laughs> okay, there's no interest on the ring. We'll go to something else. Let's do one of the bags. And this one is two pounds, five ounces. It's a wearable craft lot. 99.9% .9 is wearable. I always start my bid at $10 on these bags. And I will show you a few pieces. These are the only things I don't wrap. Everything really. I do pad these really well and put them in a flat rate envelope for $8.45. Now, I did put a belt in here. I'm not crazy about selling belts, but this one is in excellent condition. Also, the real reason I put it in there, look what you could do with crafts for this. You could, I would remove these. You could make necklaces. Um, you could do jewelry art. There's just a lot of things that you could do with this. So that's why I put that in there. <clears throat> Normally, I do not. I don't like selling belts. Here is a cuff bracelet, enameled, in excellent condition. And this has a ribbon put through it. I'm not crazy about ribbon because, um, I mean, they can be washed. This one actually needs washing, but I put that for the stones. It also stretch, so I don't know put the ribbon. But those are great for crafts. But it is very wearable. Gold color. That's my email. She could send it me also if you rather do it that way Irene but chaps moving fast <laughs> a lot of people are unrestricted I know my rent just went up and a couple of other things went up so I know how it one is it's going to be a struggle but we'll make it. It's actually much. Hi, Ellie. Welcome, welcome. And this is this bag starts at ten dollars. It weighs two pounds five ounces. And that. That's this. A wrap bracelet. And let's see, I've got some, <laughs> there's some new pieces in here too. It's that bracelet. <coughs> Excuse me. This has some little blue stones. And Ellie's in it tan. Thank you, Ellie. Here's a nice statement. 0.9% wearable. And this is paparazzi. And those chokers. And this is really cool. This is a pin. It says bloom grows blossoms. And uh, 
I won't read it all, but Blossoms is a line of thoughtfully designed gifts that celebrate those who have made a difference in someone's life, whether you're a mom, a mentor, teacher, sister, or friend. That's kind of cool, I think. There's a lot of potential with this lot. And... We're up to 10. Does anyone want to go and close it? There's another statement piece with the rest. And Myra's up to 11. Ellie's in at 12. I said they're, I actually, I, they're mostly, like I said, 99.9. .9. I call them a craft wearable because this way I can put a few pieces that maybe, maybe have one missing stone you know, not perfect, but it's not junk. I can tell you that. Myra's out. I'm going to close it for Ellie then. Thank you, Myra. Going once to Ellie for 15. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Ellie for $15. Thank you, Ellie. And I do have another bag that I will just show now too. This over here. Let's do this other one. This one is two pounds, four ounces. Now, this is kind of weird. I don't know why. They're all earrings, but why would they have? Well, okay. One has kind of like a copper color. One is um more like gold and the other's darker anyway they are new on the card and starting bid on this is also ten dollars there is a stretch uh ring there is a little discoloration on the band <coughs> roscoe stop <coughs> Excuse the noise. There is a Does anybody want a dog? I'll ship them free. <laughs> Excuse me. Stop. Stop being so noisy. That bark would scare anyone off, that's for sure. And there's this necklace. And this is very, very clean. <laughs> now, beads are, look at the sparkle on these beads. Really nice crystal. And does not look like it's ever been worn. Myself, I would take the tassel off, but... And on this brace. And there's a statement piece. These here are plastic, but look at the color. They are really a gorgeous book. More like a, teal, a dark teal. But in my screen, it looks more blue. And in person, it looks more teal. So, let's see. <laughs> I am, that's the only 
jewelry pieces I ever lose is earrings. That's why I started. I used to have some nice like 10 and 14 karat gold earrings. And I would lose um, one earring. So I started wearing fashion earrings. There is one missing stone on right here on that piece. This is very cold to the touch. What do you mean? Is there a storm somewhere? Oh, you're asking Allie? I know a lot of places have a lot of hot weather. I think it's about 84 here, which is nice. I like that. We don't get super hot. Here's a nice statement piece. I look on my end, I'm clear. I don't know if you're if you're having problems, go on out and then come back in. So I'm in Southern California. We don't have a storm. But I am my picture is very clear to me. This is really different. Kind of artisan made. Yeah, <laughs> my family's on vacation, not me. This is really nice. It says, let us rejoice and be glad in it. Psalms 11824. Here is a brooch. This will be great for crafts. It looks painted. This is a really old piece. You wish you had some rain in the UK. And Myra's in at 10. Thank you, Myra. And this, I love the color of these. These are plastic. Good condition. Beautiful color. There are some earrings. And they're the other earrings in the bag. Let's see here. So we're up. Pins, anyone want to go higher? This is beautiful sea beads. Beautiful uh, hot pink. And we don't have storms very often here in Southern California. Now on my camera, it looks like orange. It's a really beautiful red in person. I don't know how it looks on the other end, but I put this in mostly for crafts. I think somebody just added this to it, the stretch bracelet. But I thought, you know, you could use it for crafts. And here is a necklace. I, I never thought I would have this many lady friends. Oh, you're sweet talking them all, bold lion. <laughs> okay, I'm going to close it for Myra if there's no other interest. Going once to Myra for 10. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Myra for $10. Thank you, Myra. Thank you. Thank you. Let me put everything back in the bag.
All right, let's get those out of the way. And let's check. Hopefully, I didn't miss anybody. I need to look at the chat here. Well, I certainly apologize if I've missed anyone. This is a real different bracelet, I think. Um, I think it's artisan made. It does have a, well, it actually was made in China, so I guess it wasn't. The It says Jane Marie on it, and it has a website address. What's different about it is they put a penny, and I think it's, from what I can see it, with the loop, it was 2001. That sense doing videos on. Oh, that's neat, Bold Lion. And it's brand new on the card. I would clean uh, the penny. I think it looks kind of dark. But I am going to start the bid at $3 on this one. Like I said, the penny says 2001. I don't know if this is genuine leather. It kind of feels like it. And, but I'm not 100% sure. So, did I even type it in? Okay. And it's very nice. Looks like it has a, looks like a bug on there. A bee, maybe. Okay. <laughs> yeah, full screen is the best. You must be you must be on your phone. It's a lot harder. Please look. Sign spaces would like the cross bracelet for five. Oh, okay. The cross bracelet. Let me get that. Thank you, Ellie. I appreciate that. Okay, this one, right? It is yours, Myra. Thank you. I appreciate all the help. It, when the chat goes fast sometimes, and like I said, I'm not home. I'm distracted by animals. <laughs> but next Saturday, I can do my sale from home. Anyway, if there's no interest, let's pass on this one. And, well, this, speaking of crosses, and this is brand new in the pack it says pocket prayer it says look inside the lens to see the serenity of prayer and it's like a key and i'm going to start the bid at three on this one hi english rose Joe, you love to call me Josephine, don't you? <laughs> Irene's in at three. And Myra, you could go up in quarter increments if you'd like. I think this is really neat. I love that. And I love that prayer. Myra's in at 
325. Hi, Leon. Irene is in at four. And English Rose, I have my chocolate today. Irene's in at 450. Let's see, maybe I can get it close. Thank you. You're so sweet. I've had a busy week. <laughs> oh my gosh. I had about three or four inches of water. Something broke in the master bathroom here. And I had to turn the water off on the bottom, you know, with that faucet under the toilet. But I, it was like I was waiting in a pool. Okay, Irene's out and Myra's uh, in at 525. Oh, my computer, what is written on your red coffee cup? My red coffee cup says, turn your eyes upon Jesus. It's actually my uh, daughter-in-law's cup. Okay, I'm going to close this for Myra, going once to Myra for 525. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Myra for five twenty-five. Thank you, Myra. Myra, can I pester you and have you see? I have my file and stuff at home for addresses. If you bought, you know, recently they pop up on, on uh, PayPal. But it's been a while for you. So if you don't mind, would you send me your information again? I hate to ask you, but I'd like to get everything shipped out in one day. Let me put my email address. I didn't, I should have brought my file with me. But I had so much stuff to bring that. This is really beautiful and it's really cold. These actually could be hematite. Has a spring ring clasp. Oh, that's right. You moved, too. And in, you know, my address, those three zeros are the number zero, not the letter zero. This is a beautiful bracelet. It's about a seven inch. Let me measure it. And make sure. Yeah, I had so much stuff to bring over here that I didn't bring... Seven inches. And I'm going to start this at four. Hi, UFC fan. <laughs> well, um, we have 27 in here. One. And I'll do a few more and then we'll do a drawing. Whoa. Oh, dog. This dog doesn't drive me crazy. If I put him outside, he barks so much. And, and we have neighbor next door has little children and they might be taking a nap or something. So I don't like to do that. But if he gets too annoying, I'll put him down the hall. Starting bid is four if there's any interest. He's a Bernice mountain dog and he weighs about 95 pounds. He's very lovable, but he's pesty. He wants attention 24 seven and he misses uh, my grandsons. They play with him, you know. Hi, Deborah Reyes. Good to see you. Six 
So, you know, he kind of follows me around and, you know, I have work to do. So, but he is, he is a good dog. He's just pesty. Okay. Let's go to something else. I did show this last week. It is Hallmark. It's a beautiful enamel bracelet. And it even has, they don't put, you know, the logo tags on stretch bracelets very often. And there is the paper tag. It's marked $32. And like I said last week, I don't think I'd pay $32 for it, but it is a beautiful bracelet. I am going to start it at $4. That good thread, never been worn. There is little crystals and there's no missing stones. Hi, my pal Sal Vintage, welcome. Yeah, it's hard um, when you're on your phone, uh, Buttercup. If I'm multitasking, sometimes I'll watch videos on my uh, phone, but I prefer my computer or my iPad. Okay, there's no interest. Like I said, in anything that hasn't sold, you can go and watch the replay and send me an email. I do not have a problem with that. Here is a really nice stretch ring. I never used to be the, a fan of stretch rings, but I'm starting to really like them. There is no discoloration on this at all. Oh, you're on your computer. Oh, okay. You should have a good screen then. Um, I'm going to start the bid at um, $3 on this one. It looks brand new. And it's got three really pretty pink stones. Most likely they're just glass. It is silver tone. No discoloration. Hi, Patty. Patty Paws. Welcome. Irene is in at three. That is really pretty. Anyone want to go higher? Okay, going once to Irene. In twice. Fair warning. And sold to Irene for. I'm a little bit worried about what the Evie and Irene have cooked up for us, though. Me and Carol. I don't know. Could be interesting. It's just funny. Okay. <laughs> well, I knew it would be funny. You guys I have to do something that's funny. And that's what it's supposed to be. We're supposed to just have fun, laugh, goof off. Look at this bracelet. It's very wide. Let me measure this. It is about one and three quarters inch. But look at the scene on it. Isn't that pretty? 
I'm going to start the bid at four on this one. Hi, Bethany, and Bethany's in at four. It's very nice and smooth. I don't see any. I don't see any problem with this bracelet. And inside has, oh gosh, let's see if I can show you this heart. It's got. There we go. It's got heart on the bottom there. Yeah, it's got one. It must be a logo. And I did not clean the inside. Could use some cleaning. It has two hearts on it, but the outside is absolutely beautiful. Thrifty little cows in at five. And I apologize for moving around so much, but my stool is not comfortable at all. Bethany's in at six. They've done a really excellent job on this. The scenes are so pretty. Thirty little cows in at six fifty. Bethany's in at seven. Look at the birds. Well, I guess they're. I don't know. Are they supposed to be birds? No, I'm not sure. I guess they're supposed to be birds. Thirty little cows in at eight. Bethany's up to nine. Thirty little cow is out. Okay, going once to Bethany for nine. Going twice. Air warning. And sold to Bethany for $9. And thank you, Thrifty Little Cow, for bidding. Okay, let's do one more and we'll have a drawing. I know I showed this before, but it's a brand new bracelet. It would make a nice gift. It says make a wish. And I didn't pay bought it at Hallmark when they were going out a store close to me. It's going out of business. It's a beautiful silver tone. I am going to start it at four. And it is brand new on this one. This would make a nice gift. You know somebody who likes things like this. And remember, it's July. I hate to remind you, but before you, time goes much too fast. Before we know it, it'll be the holidays again. Whoops. And I just tore the tag off. So I will send the tag with it if anyone buys this. Good job, Joe. Okay, there's no interest on this one. Let's do a drawing.
three. Very nice stretch bracelet. There's no damage or anything to these. That will be the free gift. I'm really organized here. I lost my pen. Oh, Lord. There it is. Okay. There's 31 people in here. So I'm going to do from 1 to 50. Your numbers, Ann. Let's see. Um, Kathy, Crochet Queen, would you like to change your number? There's uh, Deborah Reyes has 37 and she is before you on my screen. So if you will change your number. And Irene, um, let's see, Buttercup has 33, so you need to change yours. Johanna, if you will, you can actually put a number in if, and welcome, by the way, if you send me your information. Let me put my email address in and send me your information and um, you can you can put a number in now and then uh, I need your if you happen to win the drawing and there's 33 has already been used so would you please change that 33 must have been a popular number today Three of you has chosen. So you just need to put a new number in. So Ellie, you're in Mexico. On vacation. Okay, I'm going to put stop. Okay. Siri, I need a number between 1 and 50. The answer is 3. Wow. <laughs> she went low. And it's always a number before if no one gets it right on. So... It's not the number after. Robin, congratulations. Boy, there's a lot of higher numbers. Congratulations, Robin. It is yours. And I will do two more drawings as time goes on. So my granddaughter just said, this person is coming. <laughs> oh, it's, it's never dull over here. Hmm. Okay. Animals sit with uh, a... Now, I have a very pretty brooch. I think it's unusual, the color combination. It's pink, and then there's 
kind of a an orangey color. I know that's not a good addition. It's got open back. This is a vintage piece. I'm going to start the bid at four on this one. If I can get my mouse in the right place. And Robin's in at four. Hi, Evie. Where is the dog? Excuse me, one minute. Oh, good. Good deal. Oops. I'm going to put the dog in the hallway, so excuse me, one minute. As somebody comes to the door, he's going to bark again. Hey, on the tree? Come on, look it. Look what I got, Rob. Look it. Come on. There you go. Okay, I took care of that problem. Yeah. <laughs> Well, this lady, I guess, is supposed to come by and bring some rabbit supplies, and this dog will go crazy, so I put him in the hall. I have to bribe him with treats to get him down there, but... Okay, going once. Robin for four. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Robin for $4. Thank you, Robin. Now I have, there's two brand new uh, prayer box pendants. Let me take it out. And I do have two of them. Excuse me, one minute. I'm going to bring these that stuff in. Thank you. I'm doing an auction, so I'm trying to hurry. I'm online. If you just set them in here, right here. I put the dog in the hall. interruption okay okay I am going to start bid at uh, three dollars these are brand new I do have two of them and let me measure the chain. I think it's about 18 inch that's usually what they put on these <clears throat> pendants that are already packaged up <clears throat> or in boxes. So about 16 and about a two inch extender. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but he's down the hall. His barking would have been, <clears throat> if someone, you know, if if we open the door, if you don't hang on to him, he will squeeze out, and he's a runner.
And let's see, let me show you. Box opens. Okay, there's no interest. We'll go on to something else. He's a naughty boy. He's actually very sweet, but he is the pest. Now, I showed this last week, the beautiful watch. I put a new battery on. You can see it running. I am going to start the bid at 8 on this one. Beautiful pink stone. Not sure what it is. It's not plastic. I know that. It's possibly just glass, but it's possibly something else, too. But if you like to wear a watch, but you don't actually like the face of the watch to show, that is very elegant, I think. It's in good condition. There's not even any scratches on the back of this. And Ellie's in at eight. And it does have a new battery. I put new batteries in all the watches that I sell. In fact, I had to order new, more batteries because I have more watches and I ran out of the batteries. Yeah, the pink is gorgeous, really. Okay, Ellie's in at eight. Does anyone want to go higher? Sorry about that. Trying to write same time as show. Okay, going once. Ellie for eight. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold the Ellie for eight dollars. Thank you, Ellie. Appreciate that. And like I said, I will get invoices out tonight. It might be late because I'm going on to um, the comedy hour with Irene and Evie and Carol. Something new that they've come up with. And it should be fun. Okay. I've never shown this before. It's got it's dark metal. There's no missing stones. And this needs to be cleaned. I have not cleaned it. But it is really pretty, I think, anyway. I'm going to start the bid at five on this one. And like I said, the chain needs to be cleaned. But I haven't been home this week, so I did run home twice to get my mail. And that was all. And let me measure. The pendant itself is three inches. The chain is 22 inches. Oh, nice. Nice to see you, Angie. Evie is, uh, Irene, would you put Evie's, uh, Link in, please. It's a Canadian scrapper, Evie. But if 
I, Irene's probably still here. If not, uh, somebody else might put uh, the link. Any interest in this one? Okay. Yeah, and it's going to start um, pretty much after I finish here. So, what do I want to do next? Oh, I know there's... Here's another watch. I like the way it's a Geneva. I like where they match the face band. And this is like that rubber. And it also has a new battery. It has the stones all around the face. There's no missing stone. Has a stainless steel back. And I'm going to start the bid at six on this one. You can see it running. Has a Japan uh, movement. Yep, look at that. It's like a mirror. <laughs> and it's really nice, actually. I think Geneva makes a good watch. Hi, Lucky Seven. Welcome. Okay, there's no interest on this watch. We'll go on to something else. I like this pendant. I love bling bling. And they made this one a little different. Um, they actually, the clasp is in the front. Look at the bling on this heart. And that pendant, and I've got two pieces in this lot. Okay, if I can open the package. That is and this is definitely a vintage piece. And I'm going to start the bid four on this. And I love this, this heart. <laughs> it's actually a double heart. <coughs> and Bethany's in at four. And the metal on this is really beautiful. This looks new. This is, this one here, vintage piece. It has a fold over clasp. Anyone want to go higher? I love the baguettes on here. Yeah, it's really nice. Okay, going once to Bethany for four. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Bethany for $4. Thank you, Bethany.
Hopefully everyone's having a good Saturday. And I think this is pretty. If I'm surprised, you know, it's a paparazzi. I didn't know they did a lot of the, you know, beads like this. This particular looks like sea beads. It's actually very, very nice. It is brand new on the card. <clears throat> Going to start the bid at three dollars. A lot of work in these beads. Bethany's in it. It has matching ears. Anyone want to go high? Okay, going once to Bethany. For three, going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Bethany for three dollars. Thank you, Bethany. Everyone's disappearing on me. We're down to seven people. Wow. Oh. Okay, thank you, thank you. And I will do some dollar ones at the end. This is a lovely bracelet, I think, anyway. Has a fold over clasp. Let me. There we go. And I did I did clean this one in jewelry cleaner. It's very pretty. Say, I don't think we were this low. We're down to six. That's okay. I'm going to start this at four. It has open back. Very pretty. Uh, Buttercup, you only have to bid four. You don't have to bid four and a quarter because no one else has bid before you. It's very pretty. Let me measure the length of it. Let's see. Seven inches. Yes, four. Okay, I'm going to close it for you, Buttercup. Going once to Buttercup for four. Going twice. Fair warning. And so, thank you very much. Okay. Lower well, back up to 12. <laughs> we went from 31 down to. Oh, that's okay. Something more exciting, more power to them. And that needs cleaning. I miss all my equipment because I have polishing cloths and everything at home. And I am going to start this at three. What's too small? 
Oh, the bracelet? Okay. We'll take your name off of it then. No problem. Oh, Irene, would you put uh, Evie's uh, link in? Because somebody was asking about the comedy, our comedy club tonight. Anyway, this is a very nice cross, nice chain. I'm going to start the bid at four on this one. And let me measure. And this could, you know, a woman could wear it, a man could wear it. It's kind of a unisex, um, about 22 inch chain. The cross itself is two inches. And starting bid is three, if there's any interest. I love this box chain. as a lobster clasp. Hi, Chris. I couldn't remember who was asking, but <laughs> it's been wild around here today. Okay. I don't see any interest. Let's see here. Here is a cute little butterfly bracelet. There is Evie. This is really pretty. Butterfly and the fish. Look at that. Silver tone is beautiful. No discoloration. Mike, I think it, I can't guarantee it, but I, I think it is stainless. Let me grab it. It is not Hallmark. And I've looked everywhere. But I thought, hi, Mike. <laughs> anyway, I start the bid at three on that. If you're interested. And this looks like abalone. I am going to, uh, yeah, I started the bid at four on this. And then the fish. Let me measure this one. Can't be right. Um, I have what I see right now. I see uh, eight people in here. It fluctuates and then 30 thumbs up. But you know, it's funny. I can go on my phone and it'll show a different number. It's weird. Okay, bracelet is seven and a half inches. And starting bit is four. This is really pretty. Pretty, pretty. And what I love about pieces like, you know, when they're, there's no discoloration, they look new. No interest. 
Sometimes YouTube has problems with their <coughs> accuracy on counts. <clears throat> This reminds me of Pandora. It, of course, it is not the Pandora, but it is a beautiful bracelet. I would wear this one. Look at, look at that bead. How pretty. Starting bit is four on this one. Bethany's four. Anyone want to go higher? Okay, going once to Bethany for four. Oops. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Bethany for four dollars. Thank you, Bethany. It's a really pretty bracelet and it looks like new. It looks like new. Let me see here. This is a pretty pendant, I think, anyway. Kind of a, a peach color. Open back. It just, it's like silk. Beautiful. Chains in mint condition. Lobster clasp. Starting bid is four. And a nice lobster clasp, a, a good size one. Look at that. It's a really nice size. Let me measure this. About 30 inches with the two in, three inch extender. Really pretty piece. This would be nice for fall with a sweater. Make a lovely Christmas gift. And we'll pass on one. Now, I have uh, some fashion rings here. They're just inexpensive rings. Just got accumulated, you know, with the bags of jewelry that I buy. These are very different. They're like a copper color. I don't know if anyone would even ever be interested in them. You could also use those for jewelry art. There's three of those. I'm just going to lot these up. adjustable. There's this one here. This here. This is a smaller one. Let's see what size that. That's sitting at about six and a half. You could actually, I think, adjust that one by pulling on it. I'm not going to. There's three of these enamel Rings, seven, and there's a six and two sevens, and then there's this one here. 
Yeah. Now, if anyone wants, there's three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's nine rings. If anyone wants those for five dollars, just put in a five. And you can have them all for five. I just want to get rid of them. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Let's see here. Okay, this has a tangle. If anyone buys it, when I ship it, it won't be tangled. I can promise you that. If anyone wants this for $3, just put a three in. Got a nice chain, lobster clasp. It is tangled. So maybe, let's see if I can get it out right now. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I got it untangled. Nice long chain. If you need chains, you know, the chain is actually that much. Okay, I'll pass on that one. I have some bracelets that I showed before, and there is three, there's six of these. If anyone wants those, an A3. They're in mint condition, wrong with him. And... They look good wearing all six of them together. Look at those. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Three dollars. They're just a, all you have to do is put three or want. And you will get these. We're back up to 18. Woohoo. Okay. Here's a paparazzi still in the bag. Look at those. Okay. Look at those bubbles. Anyone wants those for three, just put in a three. It has matching earrings. I might just put those in a craft wearable lot. Let's see. What do we got? Well, these are, this is vintage. Vintage, vintage.
Look okay, at yeah. it. They're not, you know, like I said, a lot of the vintage pieces were very short. They were much smaller people than today's people. It's beautiful, actually. Look at the, look at the sparkle. I'm going to start the bid at three on these. Bethany's in at three. They're in excellent condition. You could not go down to uh, Hobby Lobby or Michael's and buy these for jewelry making for $3. Chris is in at four. Lovely shine. Bethany's in at five. These, these used to be so popular. I remember my mother used to just love this type of uh, necklace. Are you out, Chris? Chris is out, going once to Bethany for five. Twice. Fair warning. And sold to Bethany for five dollars. Thank you, Bethany, and thank you, Chris, for bidding. I don't know if it's just because it's red that I like it, but I think it's really pretty. Also starting the bid at three on this one. There's the back. Yeah, silver tone in red. And Buster Class. I think this See this with a sweater for the holidays. Yeah, I love red. I just, my, like I said, since I was a little kid, red was always my favorite color. So I don't know if it's because of the color that I like this so much, but it's really pretty. Even the chain. Look at the chain is little. Uh, metal beads. Very nice. Very pretty. 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 And let's go to a bracelet. This is very, very cold to the touch. Looks like to me. And I'm going to start this one at four. Hi, Rowan Ellis. Been a long time since I've seen you. Welcome. 
Bethany's in at four. Let me show you each bead. Anyone want to go higher? They're pretty. Really pretty. Okay, going once to Bethany for four. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Bethany for $4. Thank you, Bethany. Where is that? Let's see here. Okay. Let's do a statement piece. This is an unusual color. It's like almost a a greenish gray, if that makes sense to you. It would have looked better on my lighter board that's at home. It's in excellent condition. And if anyone wants this for $4, just put four or want. Open back. I like much better if there's that the light reflect. Endeavor Reyes, it's yours. Thank you, thank you. I'll do a couple more and then we'll do another drawing. <clears throat> now, if you know someone who needs a larger bracelet, this one is really nice. But I know, you know, it is way too big for me. It's a beautiful enameled bracelet. But it is for a larger wrist. Let's see how big it is on me. And if anyone wants this one for $4, just put in a four or want. Looks brand new. I love the way they made this. I wish this was smaller. A very classy piece of colors, not 54. <laughs> oh. It is yours. Hi, Kelly. Welcome, welcome. Okay. Let's do this one. I know. <laughs> I know you weren't bidding 54. This one's different. And it actually is hallmarked. Let's see if I can read it. I think it's Premier. It's got the crown and in... 
And this one also needs some cleaning. Let me put this on the board and see if you can see it better. And I'm going to just do a buy it now for four on this one if anyone wants it. And it is Hallmark. And I'm dropping things as usual. But this one, I'll tell you, it does need cleaning. I try to clean as much as I can. But like I said, this week I have not been home. So it's about 18 and a half inches in Deborah Reyes. It is yours. bling down there too. Here's another uh, statement piece. I think it's very nice. If anyone wants this for four dollars, do a buy it now. Just put in four or one as the open back. And Deborah Reyes, it is yours. Thank you, thank you. It's so quiet with Roscoe down the hall. <laughs> I love it. Um, okay. really different but it's really pretty I think whoever gets it in person you that will be the free gift it's in mint condition people in here so let's do uh, 1 to 25 okay put your numbers in Okay, uh, Bethany, change your 17. Um, Deborah Reyes has 17 first. There we go. 
So one, two, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have twelve people in here and ten numbers. So I am just going to click stop. And let's see what he has to say. Siri, I need a number between 1 and 25. 12. Okay, let's see. We have, and it's always the number before, not the number after. So the number before is 7. Congratulations, Bethany. It is yours. And I'll do one more drawing at the very end. I have an angel brooch. I think it's in its uh, hallmarked LC. I think she's pretty. I'm going to start the bid on this at three. If there's any interest, and Chris is in at three. Anyone want to go higher? She's really pretty. She's holding a heart. And you know, if you wanted to, you could actually put a jump ring and a chain and make that into a pendant. Okay, I'm going to close it for Chris, going once, to Chris for three, going twice. Fair warning, and sold to Chris for $3. Thank you, Chris. Okay. is another uh, vintage rhinestone piece. Actually, I've got three pieces in this lot. Let me start here with this one. And these are vintage pieces. These are rhinestones. Come on, camera, focus. That one. And that one. And those two are, are vintage. This one possibly is not. But still very, very pretty. So there's three pieces. I'm going to start the bid at five on the three pieces. I think this is my favorite of the three. Okay. Um, Bethany was in first with five. So, uh, Deborah, you have to go up. And Chris came in at six before you, Deborah. So, okay, Deborah is in at seven. I love some of the old vintage pieces. Chris is in at eight. At one time when I 
first started on eBay, that's what I sold was vintage pieces. Those are my favorite, and that's where I'm the most knowledgeable is uh, the vintage. Okay, Deborah Reyes is out, and Bethany is, came in at 9. Chris came back at 10. So I'm just waiting on Bethany to see if she's out. And she is out. Thank you for bidding. Going once to Chris for 10. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Chris for $10. Thank you, Chris. And thank you, everyone, for bidding. These are really pretty pieces. I love the bling. Like I said, that's my favorite of um, the bling in jewelry. Now, I don't know if there'd be any interest in this. It's, it's different. It's but it's two-tone, and I was taught a long time ago, if you put one piece on that has both or all three metals, all you need is one piece, and then you can mix your metals. But look at that. That's silver tone, and then that's gold tone. It's really different. It's actually like new. I mean, it's pretty. It has a spring ring clasp. If anyone wants this piece for $3, just put in a three or a want. But even if you wanted to remake this, look at that chain. It's a beautiful chain. Actually, it remove this very easily. It would be, this is one of the easiest um, things to redo. Look at the shine. That's pretty. Has a spring ring clasp. In fact, if I don't sell it, I'll just, I'll remake this myself. That is a, one of the easy fixes. Oh, this is pretty. The lady likes it. Yeah, you can always tell when I like something. Look at the abalone. This is pretty. But naturally, Joe's going to tangle it up. Ah. Okay, it, well, I promise it won't be tangled if you buy it, but look at that. It's an abalone shell. That is beautiful. I'm going to start to bid at five on this one. I love how they did that. Chain needs a little bit of cleaning. Look at that. It has a lobster clasp. And let's measure it. So 18 and a three and a half inch extender. So about 21 inches with the extender. It, it is beautiful. <laughs> I actually um, had a custom order a couple years ago for one of my uh, jewelry art crosses. And the lady uh, requested 
abalone or abalone colors. And so I put some abalone in it and it turned out pretty, I think. She was with it anyway. That is that is a beautiful piece. I wish I would have had this when I made that uh, cross for her because I would have put that as the focal point of the cross. That is really pretty. Okay, no interest in that one. This is a very heavy bracelet. It looks like an Oriental, an Asian, I say Oriental. Look at, definitely. It's very heavy. It's a stretch bracelet. I'm going to start it at three. That on that side. Bethany's in at three. But the beads on this are really heavy. By just looking at it, I couldn't imagine that it would be that heavy, but it is. It's very nice, though. Very different. I've not seen this piece before. And I've seen a lot of jewelry in my life. Bethany's in at three. Is there any other interest? Going once to Bethany for three. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Bethany for $3. Thank you, Bethany. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Well, I don't know if the count's right, but uh, from my screen, it looks like I'm down to three people. These have a retail price on them uh, for $16. They're really, they're brand new on the card. I, I'm glad you're here, Robin. I appreciate you. Now we're, it, it's just fluctuating. People must be, there must be something else going on too, which I understand. And it doesn't bother me a bit. These are really, really pretty. If anyone wants these for $3, just put in a three or a want. They're Francisca and, and Deborah Reyes. They are yours. YouTube just gets so busy sometimes and, and you know, our hours kind of conflict with each other, which is understandable. I just enjoy everyone here. Very thankful that you are here. And makes my Saturday. Oh, this is pretty. I got some pretty pieces. This is very dainty. I love pieces like this. Because I always say I don't wear statement pieces all day. I love them. But this is the type of thing I can wear all day and love it. And if anyone wants this for $3, just put three or want. It is in mint condition. And Bethany, it's yours. Okay. 
I have a lot more room here to work, but my seating arrangement is not comfortable. And I have a nice office chair at home. Oh, this is gorgeous. So I move around a lot more here, which is not good. Hopefully, I don't make any dizzy. This is like brand new. And I'm going to start the bid at uh, four on this one. It's very long. Let me measure it. Okay. It's about, about 38 inches. This is another one that's lovely for the fall or winter sweaters. It is really. This is the part I like the most. Look at that. And if you remake jewelry and you want it, you could shorten this. And Bethany is in at four. Does anyone want to go higher? This is a brand new piece. This one's never been worn. Okay, I'm going to close it for Bethany. Going once. Bethany for four. Going twice. Your warning. And sold to Bethany for $4. Thank you, Bethany. You got some pretty cool pieces. Shed panels inside and out. Oh, then we'll get... oh wow, you've been busy, English Rose. It's good to be busy, though. I'm hoping next week to do a couple of uh, videos on... Um, I'm doing a NASCAR race car junk journal. In fact, I have this stuff all spread out all over my table at home. And uh, this is really pretty. If anyone says for three, just put three or one. Our English keeps very busy and she does some beautiful jewelry art creations. In fact, I, I know I have a couple of her things on a video. If you go back and look at the playlist. She is very creative. This is a brand new piece. These little discs are plastic. But this would make a nice gift. Especially if you, you know, you have um, teenagers who maybe don't take care of their jewelry and you don't want to spend a lot of money. My granddaughter now takes care of her stuff, but when I bought her, you know, gave her jewelry when she was real little, she lost most of it. But now she's older and 
You know, one thing, she takes good care of her bunnies. Those are two of the most beautiful little bunnies. This is a beautiful chain necklace. Look at that. I don't think this piece has ever been worn. Let me see if I can put this on the board. Turn my phone off pretty soon if I don't keep keep getting messages, advertisements. Actually, this is pretty. Oh, you've been doing watercolor painting. Oh, wow. You got to send me a picture. This is beautiful. I don't think my camera is picking up the beauty on this. Yeah, I can't wait to do another jewelry art. I just have too many projects going at one time. The gold tone on this is perfection. Uh, I'm going to start the bid at four on this one. You know, I can sit down with my crafts and my jewelry art and junk journaling and it just tune out the world, tune out stress. It's really a pretty piece. This is a <clears throat> sweater piece, I think. Has a lobster clap. Yeah, if I wore this, I wouldn't even get, I would uh, get rid of this piece. But living in Southern California, I wear turtlenecks or sweaters. Get too warm. What do I have here? Oh. There is a paparazzi necklace and earrings. Does anyone want this one for a dollar? Just put one or want. Some matching earrings. Okay, no, just in that one. Let's see the other paparazzi. Wow. That was taped up quite well. Here's some more molds. Yes. If anyone wants this for $2, just put in a or a want.
It's brand new. Okay, we'll put that away. This is a very, very old brooch. This is definitely vintage. No, I can't even give it away. <laughs> and you can tell by the, the clasp here, the pin is very old. If you collect vintage, and it naturally shows where this thing is old. I am going to start the bid at $3 on it. If you collect vintage and you know much about vintage, you know that a lot of it is going to have wear. That's okay. They're sleeping today. Missing some good deals. I'm just glad everyone's here. That's here. And keeping me company. I said next week I'll be back in my own place. In my comfortable chair. And I won't be bobbing around. <laughs> but I'm glad my kids got to take this vacation. My son went to see his dad. And... Uh, in Idaho and his dad's getting up there in age and not doing as well and Mike's in at three and so the, the kids got to see their grandpa but I think this will be uh, the last vacation for a long time Oh, that's okay, Pam. I totally understand. And hi, Angie. I I know how busy, you know, our lives get. I don't get upset when someone's late or if they can't show up. I, I totally understand. I don't always get to all the live streams that I would like to. Okay, I'm going to close it for Mike. Going once to Mike for three. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Mike for $3. Thank you, Mike. Mike knows what the some of the old vintage pieces are. They're very special, actually. And sometimes they can be worth a lot more than some of the new, fancier pieces. I remember years ago, I sold a bracelet I on eBay. And it was in terrible shape, and, and I documented all that. And people wanted that. They did that and paid a, a lot for that. And it was just a very, very old piece that was kind of rare. And uh, here is, I sold all the rest of them. Uh, I think this, is it titanium or stainless? Um, this one's titanium. And it is a size 8. Brand new. Going to start the bid at $4 on this one. I actually had um, one that I sold that was a size 9. It's beautiful, very smooth. I love the feel of these rings. 
They're so smooth. Hi, Miss Carol. Carol's here. Pam's here. Got a good crowd of people. Okay, there's no interest in that one. Let's see here. Let's do some earrings. That's pretty too. Yeah, I'll have to go back and watch the replay. I I got on there when they were, they had just went to breakfast, I think. But I, I got to see it before then. And then I had to get ready for my sale. Here is um, two pairs of butterfly earrings. Bling, bling. They're in mint condition. Those are large ones, and here's small ones. I am going to start the bid at uh, $2 for both pairs. There's no missing stones, and these do not look like they've ever been worn. Really pretty. I love butterflies. And Pam, you know, if <clears throat> these would act like good in junk journals also. <laughs> Pam and I look at things as uh, we look at jewelry like what could we do with our crafting? Going blind to drivers. <laughs> Yeah. When want to go higher? If not, I'm going to close it for Pam. Let me get these in a the bag. These are pretty. Going once to Pam for two. Going twice. Air warning. And sold the Pam for $2. Thank you, Pam. Now, this I thought was pretty nice. And this is Express. It's not going to show up my black board, so let's see. Again. It's different. I'm going to start the bid at three on this necklace. It's mint condition. I don't think this piece has been worn. It's so different. It's normally, you know, they have like crystals or rhinestones, but these are the white stone like milk glass. I don't think they're milk glass, but they sure are. So it's kind of different. And then it has the one uh, strand there with uh, balls, black balls. And the bit is three on this piece.
Oh, Evie's getting you started. What is Evie doing? That girl. That should be a scream. I might have to move my computer into a more comfortable area. <clears throat> if I put it on the table, the background isn't as nice and there's a mirror back there and I didn't want the glare, but this chair is driving me crazy. It's what happens when you have short legs and you're trying to sit on a tall stool. And there's no interest on this one. Now this one, the label says about color. I don't know what it is. It's debatable if it's plastic, it feels different. Could be just a glass. Hi, Lena. Welcome, welcome. And Ma, how, how are you? If anyone wants this for a dollar, just pin one or one. And Deborah Reyes, it is yours. Okay, thank you, thank you. This is beautiful. It just needs a chain. But look at this. Pinned it. It is gorgeous. I am a going to start this at a double heart. Look at the back. It is a really gorgeous. It sparkles the rhinestones in it. And Chris is in it for. Does anyone want to go higher? A really beautiful piece. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to close it for Chris. Going once to Chris for four. Going twice. Fair warning. Okay. That's a really beautiful piece. Every time I buy a, you know, a big lot of jewelry, I have to uh, slap my hands and not let myself keep at least more than two pieces because I can get carried away. And... This is a really unusual, I shouldn't say unusual, different brooch. I think it's pretty. I think it's acrylic, but it has really pretty crystals. Isn't that pretty? And it's kind of like cream color. It's opaque. You look at, you can see, you can see through certain areas of the brooch. I am going to start this at three, starting bid three.
the pin, there's some discoloration on the pin in the back. But, the, you know, that doesn't show. Heart with the bandage. Yeah. <laughs> hey, that's a good description. Oh, but it's really pretty. That is. I've had that for a while and I just haven't put it on. Or ribbon, yeah. And you know, what brooches can be used for too, um, Pam, Pam's Treasures makes beautiful pin cushions. And I bought one from her and she has a brooch right in the middle and it's just really gorgeous. So you can put uh, brooches on pillows. You can put them in a frame. Now this is some bling. I, I think this is a newer piece. I don't think this is not vintage, but it's still very pretty. Yes, she does. She is a very classy lady. And has a good sense of humor. I'm just going to put um, $2 on this one. If anyone wants it, just put a 2 Oh, Oh, uh, Bethany, did you want the heart? Is that what the three was for? And Deborah Reyes, the necklace is yours for two. Let me get that and then see what Bethany wanted there. Yes, okay. Oh, two for all oh, for the necklace. Oh, okay. Uh, on my, no, it was a three. You had put in the three. Deborah Reyes got the two in first for um, the necklace. But above you had put in a three, and I wondered if it was for the heart brooch. Oh, okay. Um Deb can have I'm new here. Nice to meet you, Josie. Oh, brother. Evie. Okay. Deborah, the necklace is yours. Oh, Evie is always so new. Oh, but we love you, Evie. Yeah, you got to love Evie. You are the newest person on the planet, girl. Okay. This is a new, cute little necklace. Anyone wants this set for three? Just put in a three. These make nice little gifts. Say if you need a, say, you know, you want, at, like at Christmas, you bring little gifts at work even, <clears throat> and you don't want to spend or don't have a lot of money to spend, something like this is ideal. So if anyone wants this, just put a three or a want. Also, you can take it apart and use it for crafts. Evie, who is Evie? Is she new? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, she's new, okay. You never know what's going to come out of Evie's mouth. But she's a good person. Got to have humor in this life. Um, life gets too serious sometimes. 
let's see. I think I have another one of these. No, that's still size eight. I don't think I put that in the right spot. Okay. Here a bracelet. And this is the Hallmark. It's A C L E O N I. There is the tag. Hopefully it's not upside down. Beautiful toggle clasp. Going to start the bid at $4 on this bracelet. This one has been cleaned. Oh, I'm glad, Evie. We, we don't want any new person to not feel welcomed, Evie. It's so amazing, though, that you become new every week. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I better save it up for the comedy hour, huh? Okay, it's eight, but you can also make the seven. That's what I like about this. Look, it has three different loops. And Deborah Reyes is in at four. Does anyone want to go higher? Has a lovely toggle clasp. Oh, Evie's brand new. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yes, we want we want Evie to feel welcome, right? <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, those are beavers. <laughs> I'm still waiting for her to name that one beaver. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm closing for Deborah. Deborah. <laughs> you guys are cracking me up. Going once to Deborah for four. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Deborah Reyes for four dollars. Thank you, Deborah. Is the beaver whisper? <laughs> yeah, she is that for sure. What is this? Well, this is pretty. This is another vintage piece. I almost forgot about this one. Look at that. And I'm going to start this one at four. As a fold over clap. I come from my mom. <laughs> Deborah Reyes is in at four. Has a fold over clasp. And let me measure this one. It measures uh, six and a half inches. <clears throat> okay, going once to Deborah for four. 
going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Deborah Reyes for $4. Thank you, Deborah. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm surprised I can even talk with all the animal hair around. But we vacuum up all the time. Roscoe sheds like crazy. Although he just he just got groomed, I think, last week and took his hair down a little bit. So it's not quite as bad. But let's see, what is this one? Oh, I like, oh, this is funny, I think. I think it's funny. I have a weird sense of humor sometimes. It says I'm allergic to stupidity. I think that's, and it has a little um, hang tag with a little crystal in it. And if anyone wants this for $2, just put in a two. I like that. I'm allergic to stupidity. No, who's Irene? <laughs> oh, you'll find out tonight who Irene is. She's in your comedy group. You know how uh, some you can wear a bracelet with health issues and you know out allergies and stuff. Well, this is a really good one. And Pam, it's yours for two dollars. Thank you, thank you. I don't know why I think that's funny, except some of the stuff I read on Facebook, I think. Okay, that's a good one. Here is a watch, and I've showed it before. This one, all my other watches are pretty much like mint, but this one, is this the one that has six? No, this one doesn't have the scratch. Okay, this one's in good shape. I have one that has a scratch on the face, but it's not this one. It's a beautiful watch. And look at this is how it opens. Okay, there we go. It is really pretty. It has a new battery. Oh, I know. It's got one spot back there. That's why. Normally, I, I start them for more, but I'm going to start this one at $4 because of that spot. But it has a brand new battery in it. And no one sees the back of your watch when it's on your wrist. Anyone want to go higher? <laughs> I'm going once to Deborah for four, going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Deborah Reyes for $4. Thank you, Deborah. Are you guys starting the comedy hour early? <laughs> Don't use all your material. Okay. Let's see, what time is it? Oh, it's almost three hours. I'll do it more and we'll do a drawing and then we'll call it quits. Oops. Oops, what did I hit? Okay. 
I usually go three hours. My butt on this chair can't take much more than that. My office chair is going to feel like heaven. I almost kept this one. This is really pretty. Look at this stretch ring. There is no tarnish on this one at all. <laughs> yeah. I'm sitting on... Have you ever you went into a restaurant where they had those tall bar stools? Well, that's kind of like what I'm sitting on. And I have very short legs. And my butt's sore. <laughs> oh, gosh. Anyway, forgive me for moving around like I'm a, a yo-yo today. I did that last week, too. Anyway, I'm going to start the bid at $2 on this one. Look at the bling. Isn't that pretty? Well, I'm glad I'm still able to help this out. And they were having a wonderful vacation. Pam, uh, let's see. Deborah, you'll have to go up. Pam's in it two before you like i said you can in my sales you can do quarter increments my email i will put it in it is josie j-o-s-i-e 00065 at gmail.com and the three are the number zero not the letter and pam's in at four deborah reyes is out okay going once to pam for four thank you deborah going twice fair warning and sold to pam for four dollars thank you pam And we'll do a couple more, and then we'll do a drawing. And let's see here. I forgot about these. I forgot about these. These are nice. I purchased this from LC and it was auction style. I didn't pay. It's just, uh, I've seen it or I bought this one. And someone actually paid over $30 for it. I didn't pay that much for it. It was auction style. This is like the copper color. Um, those are created emeralds. I am going to start the bid at $10 on this one. The beautiful ring. Almost forgot about these. It is a yeah, seven and a quarter. Pam likes the bling too. We love bling. But those stones are beautiful. And I've not, you know, it's not really, it looks like rose gold, more a little. More copper color, but it's a beautiful ring. Look at the, look at this. 
comes in at 10. Those are really pretty. Anyone want to go higher? Okay. Going once to Pam for 10. Going twice. Fair warning. And sold to Pam for $10. Thank you, Pam. I'm going to do a couple more rings and then I'm going to do the last drawing. Okay. And we have this one. It is a fashion ring. It's very beautiful. I actually bought this one from Lisa. I wore it one time. And I'm going to start the bed at 8 on this one. There is no discoloration. It's like brand new. You like bling and you want to look classy rich. It is a size 7. I can wear a seven on my left hand, but my right hand, no. I need an eight. So I buy seven eights and nines, and I wear the nine on the middle finger. That's a beautiful ring. And you know, if you travel and you have, you know, real diamonds, especially if some places where you travel, you shouldn't wear your expensive diamonds. You always want to, you can wear a nice CZ. Oh, I'm sorry. Ooh. Okay, we're in. Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You're right. You're right. I screwed up. Pam, you didn't get the ring unless you bid again. The high bid is 12. There's my friend. When I mess up her name. Okay. She's in for 12. No, you're you're still in. Pam has okay, Pam's 12 and a half. I'm sorry. I do screw up once in a while. Because I'm too busy talking. And high bid is 14. I call myself Motor Mouth. Pam is out. Okay, going once for 14, going twice. Air warning and sold $14. And thank you. And please accept my apology for messing up. Thank you, thank you. You'll love the ring. It's really pretty. It really is. I I have to do that at least once on, on a sale. I have to I, I do it every week. I miss one person at least. Okay. Oh, what did I start this one at? At yes. If anyone's interested in this one, it's for a gift. Okay. That's neat. It's beautiful. I just decided, I actually bought it for myself, but I just have too many. And, you know, you only can wear so many. To okay. There's no interest on this one. We'll pass on. 
Then we'll do a drawing. Okay. And this one is... Um, it's not sterling. It's a nice, cute fashion ring. It's silver tone. I am going to start the bid at $4 on this one. And let me measure it for you. It's about a seven and a half. You know, a ring like this, the way it's designed, it really makes your fingers look slim. Okay, no interest in that one. We will do our drawing. I've been on for three hours and two minutes. And I want to thank everyone for being here. And let's see, what do we want? I've got two necklaces. I wore this in one of my videos. That piece is a beautiful piece. And then I'm going to throw this one in. And with this, you can use an extender. I actually would take this off and put a nice heavy chain through there. But I think it's very pretty. So these are the two free gifts. <clears throat> I hope somebody will love them. And there's 17 people in. So let's do, oops, one through, one through 40 this time. Let's be different. Put your numbers in. So we have 16 people in here, and we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Only eight numbers. Hi, Cece. Come on, put some more numbers in. And you remember, you don't have to purchase to be in the drawings. So I don't see any duplicates. If no one gets it right on, you remember it's always the number before, not the number after. Hi, Hetty.
We'll put stop. And let's see what Siri's got to say. Siri, I need a number between 1 and 40. It's 34. Okay, let's see what we got here. We're at 39. And... Thirty four. Um, Joyce had thirty nine. She has 29. Okay, congratulations, Cece. It is yours. And I want to thank everyone. Hi, Cheryl. I want to thank everyone for being here and thank you for being patient with the noise of the dog and somebody at the door <laughs> and me wiggling around on this chair. Like I said, next week I will be back home doing my auction. I thoroughly enjoyed everyone. Thank you for all the purchases. Thank you just for being here and visiting. And, and remember what I've said before, even if things get bad where there's very little or no sales, I always want to be here uh, for you and we keep each other company. So I appreciate each and every one of you. God bless you. Be safe and join us in the comedy hour. I'm going to make a little pit stop here. Um, and um, I think uh, Evie will want to start the comedy hour. So see you there. Um, I will get my invoices out. It may be midnight tonight, but you'll get an invoice. And um, shipping date is Tuesday. I may this week if I get them ready because uh, I don't know if I'm going home tomorrow night or Monday morning. If I go home Monday, I'll probably ship them on the way home on Monday. If not, they'll all go out on Tuesday. Thank you. God bless. Love you guys. See you soon.